Coming up next, it's a UFC women's bantamweight division matchup. All right, almost ready to go with this one. Here is tonight's tale of the tape. More than five years apart, with similar height and some differences in reach. You ready to fight? Ready. Well, so much mixed martial arts history has been made within these very walls. We're always thrilled to come back. Great to have you with us as we broadcast live from Saitama Super Arena here in Japan. Whoa! Working from half guard. Trying to stay heavy here as best she can. Into full guard. Nice reversal. And a hammer fist. Vieta gets caught with that punch. Got to shore up the defense here. She's now in half guard again. Vieta gets caught with that punch. Elbow is the weapon of choice. Well, hard to win fights in mixed martial arts from the bottom, but nice work here in that position by Vieta. Continuing to stay busy here on the ground. Hard elbows. Good elbow from the top. Another hard elbow. Oh, nice elbows there. Oh, man. She's got a cut on her nose. Vieta gets pounded here on the ground. The elbow doing most of the damage there. Reversal here, and into full guard. Oh, elbow to the head. Vieta gets touched, and once again, it's that elbow. That has been there all night. Defense has got to be better. Oh, she lands a nice elbow there, Joe. Didn't open her up, but very well could have. Excellent sweep, winds up in guard. She's trying to secure this ankle lock. That leg looks locked up pretty tight. This is getting tighter. She might have to tap. And oh, there it is. is. Beautiful job in setting up the leg lock for the finish. Yeah, nicely done with her technique, with her grappling transitions. And she was somewhat deceptive, Joe, in the way she trapped her opponent's leg. Her opponent had no other choice at that point but to tap out. So a huge result that we are just digesting here tonight. Let's see this ankle lock one more time. This is how it's done. Absolutely perfect technique here for the tap. And here we see it again. Beautiful submission victory. So there she is, your winner by submission, and there will be no wiping the smile off her face tonight as she turns in one of the bigger highlights of her UFC career. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at three minutes, 30 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by tap out, the Destroyer. Oh, well, how good was that as you get to see her? Coming up next, it's a UFC women's bantamweight division matchup. And here is tonight's tale of the tape. More than a decade separates these two fighters when it comes to the age, with some differences in height, but big differences in reach. You ready to fight? Ready. We are underway. Opens with the left hand and lands flush. Nice one-two there. Oh! oh the hand. This could be it right here. Oh, look at this! Who saw that coming? Nice leg kick. Body kick, look at that. 
vicious combination. Splits the guard and connects there. Oh, beautiful combination. Oh, straight right. Well, she left her body wide open, Joe. Man, this could be it. Back up. She might try to finish this fight here. Whoa! Oh! Oh! Do you I believe it? it? Wow! Wow! Man! Beautiful KO for the victory early in the first. Yeah, Joe, how about the knockout there? Beautiful technique to land the fight-ending shot. And again, we're a broken record when it comes to this, but sometimes when you catch a fighter cold, maybe before she's had a chance to get herself into the fight, that strike can have a bigger effect. It certainly did here tonight. Let's take a look at it from a different angle. Well, there she is. Man, did she have it going here tonight as she gets the huge win by knockout. Near perfect execution, and that could be one of the better knockouts of the year. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at one minute, 25 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by knockout, the destroyer. Well, there are a few greater highs in all of professional... All right, coming up next, it's a UFC women's bantamweight division matchup. And here is tonight's tale of the tape. Well, how about the age discrepancy here? More than 15 years apart. Some differences in height and reach as well. You ready to fight? You ready? Well, it's a building that has hosted so many classic fights. We are underway at Madison Square Garden, right here in the heart of New York City. All right, here we go. Big power. Gigantic kicks. Oh! The kick gets through. And she's looking for the takedown here. Oh. Wow. This could be it right here. technique and winning this fight by armbar. Yeah, near perfection for her in terms of the execution of that armbar. She worked to isolate the arm, eventually secured it, and the tap came shortly thereafter. So a big win, and it goes in the books by way of the armbar here tonight. And one more time from this angle, we can see that armbar locked in tight for the tap.
And finally, one more time, no choice but to tap. So there she is, your winner by submission, and there will be no wiping the smile off her face tonight as she turns in one of the bigger highlights of her UFC career. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean is going to stop for this contest at three minutes, 44 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by tap out, the Destroyer. Oh, well, how good was that as you get to see her now celebrating with her coaches and training partners?